Welcome to another amazing video of Kansas City Chiefs news, dear fan. Right now, show your support by liking the video, subscribing to the channel, and hitting the notification bell so you don't miss any updates. The tumultuous offseason of Rassi Rice has been well documented, and it is expected that the Kansas City Chiefs second-year wide receiver will be suspended at the start of the 2024 NFL season due to his alleged role in a multi-vehicle accident in Dallas, Texas. If Rice is suspended for a significant part of the year, how will the Chiefs suggest? Gilberto Manzano of SI.com detailed the biggest roster decisions for each AFC team, and he highlighted Rice and his potential pending suspension as the impetus for KC's next big move. What will they do about a possible suspension of Ras He Rice? Rice stood out during his rookie season and was instrumental in helping the Chiefs win another Super Bowl last season. However, he may not be available at the start of the 2024 season because he faces a potential suspension for his alleged involvement in a car accident last month. Editors note, the accident occurred on March 30th. The Chiefs will need rookie wide receiver Xavier Worthy to be an immediate contributor and for Marquise Hollywood Brown to quickly get accustomed to his new team if Rice is away from the team for a significant period. This is an interesting angle because, frankly, I don't know what decision the Chiefs can make here. Rice's car accident occurred almost a month before the 2024 NFL draft, but after the headline-making free agency moves. Kansas City has already seen additional wide receiver options pass by, with Odell Beckham Jr., Zay Jones, and Tyler Boyd signing with other teams after the draft, long after KC had a decent estimate of how long Rice might be suspended. At this point, it seems the Chiefs have already made their biggest decision. There won't be major reinforcements coming unless they make an early trade for an established wide receiver looking for a new landing spot, and the length of Rice's suspension wouldn't be the main reason to trade for a player like T. Higgins or D.K. Metcalf, who would be long-term investments well beyond Rice's potential suspension window. The Chiefs could still explore signing Michael Thomas, Hunter Renfro, or Meckel Hardman, but none of them would directly replace Rice and all would be competing for a role with or without Rice on the active roster. The time for an immediate impact wide receiver decision has come and gone for the Chiefs. They are giving early looks at larger roles for their internal options while Rice likely sits out, with the chance to add one of those pass catchers closer to training camp. Again, however, the team is certainly preparing to be without Rice for much of the year. I don't think official word from the NFL will change how they view the room, barring a major surprise from the league office. Welcome to another video with incredible news about the Kansas City Chiefs, dear fan. At this moment, show your support by leaving a like on the video, subscribing to the channel so you don't miss any updates. It's no secret that if anyone is going to catch up to Tom Brady, it's Patrick Mahomes. However, the Kansas City Chiefs quarterback doesn't necessarily need Super Bowl rings to draw comparisons with the most talented NFL player of all time. According to reports by Albert Breer of Sports Illustrated, a Chiefs official compared Mahomes to Brady based on how the Kansas City star handled the media when asked about the controversy surrounding kicker Harrison Butker. Pat is similar to Tom Brady in that regard, said a veteran official, according to Breer. He just has a special talent for saying all the right things and never causing division in the locker room. Here's a bit of what Mahomes said when asked about Butker who made controversial comments in a college commencement speech earlier this month. There are certain things he said that I don't necessarily agree with, Mahomes said. But I understand the person he is, and he's trying to do everything he can to lead people in the right direction. They might not be the same values I have, but at the same time, I will judge him by the character he shows every day. And that is a great person, and we will continue to move forward and try to help build each other up to become better every day. Mahomes is already one ring away from being halfway to Brady's seven Super Bowl rings. Considering how he continues to conduct himself as a leader while dominating on the field, it will be harder to doubt that the 28-year-old player will one day catch the goat. Now I want to know your opinion about today's video, dear fan. Leave in the comments what you thought because it is important for my work. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and activate the notification bell so you don't miss any updates.